46 million Americans use food stamps, and the idea is to improve access to healthy alternatives. But small store owners are asking who would flip the bill. Retailers that accept food stamps may have to start stocking a wider variety of healthy foods or face the loss of business. I think it's an excellent idea. Um, healthy foods are expensive, and if we had you know, money to, in order to buy healthier foods, we'd be living healthier. The new rules were proposed by the U.S. Department of Agriculture on Tuesday. The USDA says the proposal is designed to ensure people who use food stamps on the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or SNAP, have better access to healthy foods. The rules would require stores to carry 168 items that the Agriculture Department considers healthy. A person using food stamp dollars could still buy as much junk food as they wanted, but they would have more options in the store to buy fruits, vegetables, dairy, meats, and bread. But for a small store, it's, it doesn't worth too much to invest that much money. Manager of the corner store in Chicopee, James Patel, says the proposal is not realistic. It sounds wise, this looks good, but like for a small store, they can't afford to buying those kind of stuff, and it's pretty expensive too. So it's like, you know, like if we don't sell, we have to stress, we have to throw it away in a trash, so we're losing the money. The convenience store industry says the proposal could affect access because some smaller stores are the only ones that serve certain neighborhoods 24-7. The USDA said the requirement may be waived in some areas. Last year, Congress required the Agriculture Department to develop these regulations. Live in the studio, David McKay, 22 News.